Loaded paychecks. Yeah. Beware. Cablevision's new boss from France has barely walked into the office and he's already put in fat salaries on the chopping block. But <laughs> you have to wonder what would happen to a U.S. CEO, an American CEO telling the French to cut back. I mean, can you imagine if the tables were reversed in this one? Here to weigh in, our very own Ashley Webster and Liz Clayman, host of Countdown to the Closing Bell. Oh, you know, guys. And Liz, this would not go over in Paris at all. Oh, let, let me tell no. you, the first word you learn, because I did a year abroad in Paris, the first word you learn is la grève, which means strike. They would strike right away, but two totally different countries. So we have Patrick, uh, the CEO, Drahi. He comes in, he's like, I'm going to be Monsieur Guillotine. I'm going to start chopping heads. But I, I just look at Cablevision stock. Okay, there may be a hefty overhead that they need to slice. Yeah. But the stock is up 60% year to date and up 71% over the past 52 weeks. So, you know, if you're looking at, at serving the shareholder or serving the business, it's going to be a tough one. Because you know what? At the end of the day, capitalism, capitalism, an American thing wins out. And this guy, Ashley, has figured it out, even though he is French. Well, he is. He's a billionaire, so he's a capitalist. Uh, it would be like us going to France and saying, you know what? You only get two weeks vacation a year. Oh, can you imagine what <laughs> that would do? Sacre bleu. <laughs> hearing you guys speak French. Well, yeah, no, that wasn't very good. <laughs> Liz is the French speaking. She's very good at French. Um, yeah, look, uh, he may have a point. Over 300 executives earning more than 300,000 a year. He says there are many layers of overpaid uh, managers at uh, Cablevision. You know what? He may have a point. Yeah, no, I, I think he does have a yes. point. I mean, look, I mean, the reality is you, you want to run your company as efficiently as of you can. Course. What I do like about what he's doing here is he's mm. offering incentive compensation. So he yes. wants to give out stock awards, bonuses, as opposed to salaries. Uh, again, kind of an American capitalist principle, yeah. Liz. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. And so this is a guy, he's a billionaire for a reason. Mm. It's hard to become a billionaire in France because of all of the restrictions and the nanny state, etc. So he's doing something right. He's also, by the way, partly Israeli, okay? And Israelis tend to be really That's brilliant true. businessmen, too. They're, but, they're smart. You know, yeah. the they're broadband smart. part of this business, Trish, is really going to be that golden egg for cable vision and we'll see what he does to develop that i just want to hear if i'm working at cable friends. vision I'm, I'm shaking my boots a little bit wouldn't you be <laughs> i you know you, yes of course you would be like, i mean ooh. yeah no you don't like the idea of that thank um, god he didn't take not. over the knicks they'd all be on like 10 bucks a week <laughs> <laughs> all right ashley thank you very my much pleasure. liz uh thank you we'll see you of at course. the top of the hour